Diamol, the king of the Gordok. Here's my team. All zoning in. It's the final wing of Diamol. Ramp down here. Oh, I think that's the tunnel. That tunnel that went, went through the last... Uh, last, uh, wing. Which was long and there was nothing there. Or we couldn't actually go through. Believe it connects to that. God, Moldar. That was a lot of, a lot of pups running around. That's a big old axe he's got. He's enraged. Frenzy. Won't be enough. Hedge cutter. Is it complete with blood? <laughs> the blood on there as well. Krieg. Looked like he was partying just there. And then a good old dance till he was till he was too tired. Smashing with you that. 30 litre stone. Now you can go back to sleep. And I got some cherry grog. Lovely. So I picked up a nose ring. <laughs> well, you're not wise to use that. Another tunnel or something over there. Although there might have been a second entrance. Into this instance. Not sure if you could have gone that way though, because then you would have skipped over that first boss. Chest in the middle here. The meaning is of that chest. down oh <laughs> see how the legs are kicked up over there I thought he sat down for a second no he's just standing on a dead body
Fingers defeated. Racks of ribs hanging from the bloody ceiling there. Some demons. I have kill rog. Kill rog. A lot of spiders here. And bugs. Another, oh, wait a minute. Upgrade a hedge cutter, but it's the same. Oh, it's indestructible, okay. What's this, what's this guy's deal? Wow. See that broken trap up yonder? The ogres are too stupid to figure out how to fix it. Clearly it needs a little tinkering. If you fix it, I bet you could lure a slip kick into it and blammo! Trapped ogre guard. Why should I bother fixing the trap? Why not just eliminate the guard? The old fashioned way? Well, from what I've gathered while waiting to be eaten by these yokels, it might not be necessary to kill every ogre you find here. The ogres were going on and on the other day about how King Gordok came to power. Specifically, he killed the previous king and took his place. Well, the king's henchmen, those that Gordok spared, immediately swore fealty to the new king. Who knows? The ogre you save could very well be your own. Figuratively speaking, of course. <laughs> Glad I could help! Well, I don't know about that quest. Keep it real! And I think I'll be back, pal. Right back! Ogres down. Oh, okay, there's the the basket. I guess it'd be easy enough to put it together, but that's all right. These people do it. <laughs> Sometimes I was being a tank in these instances is like I don't know, it's like running a daycare or something. Where somebody's getting themselves into trouble. Watch out for everybody. Q. 
Captain Crom? together. Crumb crush. No one get past me and threat to Dark King. Oh, take it. Oh, reinforcements, eh? Boots of a full moon? King, the king is right in front of us. And Chorash the Observer. Boss down. King is dead. Gordok Shackle Key used with Gordok Ogres. Ogre Shackles. Band of the Ogre King. Beautiful. All done. It's a Gordok spirit back here. All the spirits around. Okay, so we got an upgraded ring. Throw that on. A bit more haste and versatility. Oh, Mizzle the Crafty. You big boss now, you king. Oh, hail King Artraxius, king of Gordok. Now that you da boss, all henchmen will give you tribute. You left some alive, yeah boss? I'm the new king? What are you talking about? You are the king of the Goldock? Oh yes, it's good to be king. Um, you kill king, yeah? That means you take his place. That means you da new boss. Hail to da king. It's good to be da king. Oh wait, that's me. It's good to be the king. Now, let's get back to what you were talking about before. Okay, boss, when you're ready for that tribute from your henchmen, you let me know. Henchmen? Tribute? Oh, henchmen of the boss, Stomper Krieg, all three of the guards, Captain Crom, Crush, and the Observer give tribute to our new boss. If you kill a henchman, then that henchman can't give tribute. Each one you keep alive will give you more tribute. Keep all of them alive and you get big tribute. Oh, okay, so if we'd left 
Stomp Krieg, the guards, and we use that, um, that ogre suit or whatever it was. Yeah, and you get a big tribute. So I wonder if this is a thing that happens in Classy quite a bit. Well then, show me the tribute. Ah, I see. Morning glory dew, roast quail. <laughs> the best uh, tribute, but it's something. Okay. I guess it's good to be king. Better if I had a better tribute, I suppose. So yeah, interesting how you um. Yeah, I kind of wonder. I'm kind of curious as to what the best type of drops you would be able to get. Like some really good stuff there. So long as you stay here with us, you the king, you take off, and some other ogre will take your place. That's the way of the Gordok. Hail to the king! We are Lord Cleaner down and the ogres in Tanaris, all over the desert as far as an eye can see. Ogre poo, not here, no sir. Well, I'm glad to hear it. Used with Gorok Ogre Shackles. Does that mean... Does that mean like a free not Thimblejack? Although they're not... They wouldn't be Ogre Shackles. They're Ogre Built Shackles, right? Ogre Crafted Shackles, but they're not Shackles for an Ogre. That's not too far away. We'll have a little look. What about the demon? Does the demon want to talk? When I scouted you before you became the new king, um, I, I was just joking. Yeah. Just joking. Just jokes. Time is money, friend. Free not. <laughs> It's called the Gordok Shackle Key. Well, that's what these tons of fun keep calling it. I think any of the ogres might have it, but I'm not sure if any specific ones do. Maybe the guards have a better chance of having one. What am I talking about? You have it already, don't you? Is that it there? <laughs> Keep it real. Oh, thank you for freeing me. You ranked number one. Everyone else ranked number two or lower. I knew my life was destined for more than just being an appetizer to some ogre. Not Thimblejack's cash. Right back. All right. <laughs> well, you free pal. Help. So you can get out of here. Whenever you feel like it, convenient crate. Oh, okay. I got a 16 slot bag out of that. And a girdle of insight. Interesting. Binds when equipped. So... Where'd that crate go? Where's my box? Do you see it? It went. It was there. <laughs> it's in my inventory somewhere. Crate. Where is it? It's gone. Oh, hang on. I didn't open everything. Convenient crate. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's a reagent bag. Ah. So it, would have been, it wouldn't have been around back then, but... Interesting. Okay. So all the reagents go there. Huh. That's pretty cool. Well, that was worth it. Alright, so now I just gotta go and travel back to the beginning. I did free that guy, I gave him the keys, but he seems content just to sit there. Let's go and do it the quick way, seeing as this person's still in my... Still in my party. Yes, I can see that you are indeed successful. You have received your tribute. The Gordok advance will exist no longer, and the Gordok are blissfully ignorant. This is a true winner's scenario, Artraxius. 
Pauldrons of Tribute. Fantastic. Now, one thing I did want to do is go around this side. I just want to see. Oh, these guys are. They don't. Oh, because I left. I left, but they're not attacking me because the other guy's the king, right? Ah, that's why. And they're celebrating, they're dancing. Oh, okay, so I just went around the other side. Gotcha. Alright, so we can leave this place. Great, well that's the dime all done. We completed everything. Um, everything in Feralis as far as I could tell. Of course, I didn't do that little uh, goblin's quest, but I'll let that one be. So, 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 from here... From here, from here, I'll tell you what I did from here. From here, I actually put it up on the, um, I put it up on the community tab for a vote to see where we go next. Because we haven't got too much left to do, really, um, in terms of zone story quests. So that's what I'm concentrating on, folks, just in case there was a bit of confusion. So I know there's quests in Teldrassil and so on. Well, actually, I don't know if they're available to me I guess if I have to, have to do something special to make them come back but yeah like in the starter zones and all that business I know there's that but that's not actually part of the achievement so I'm not doing those I did the ones that were important to us which was Elwyn Forest and so on um so like Dunmoreau and all that there's no zone story as such I mean, I guess there rears in a way. Ah, uh, hell, uh, you know, maybe at the end of it I might go back and do them all, but yeah, right now all I'm concerned with is getting the Law Master side of things done. So I'm doing those quests. Alright. Now, I left, I put it up on the uh, community tab, and you all voted for Blood Mist Isle. As you missed, being the Draenei starting area, but there is a Law Master attached to the blood mist isle so we'll be going there and you can see there's actually the zone story there as well so it shows up here but it wouldn't show up here so that's where we're going to go next but first but first to satisfy my curiosity we're going to go over the top and we're going to go revisit tanaris for a second because there is three chicken quests right and i've got two of them Let me see if I can if I can bring that up. Robert here. Tastes like chicken? No. I thought there was an achievement attached to it. Keep DPSing and nobody explodes. Okay. Well, even if there isn't, I'm going to go over there and see if it's still there. I figure I might as well get them all done at the same time fire over that top of Ungoro. Many of these zones that we have uh, we have gone through. So yeah, it's been it's been a bit of a journey. I'll t I'll give you a brief rundown of what we did of how we were born. So we were of course born in a we started in North Shire and then we went to uh, Elwyn Forest and I think we went to Westfall before flip flopping back to flip flop into Red Ridge Mountains over here. We did all that, then we went south to... Well, we didn't go that far south, hang on. <laughs> Red Ridge Mountains, then we went down here to Duskwood. We did Duskwood, Stranglethorn Vale. Uh, the north side, the south side, and I think from there we took a boat from Booty Bay. From Booty Bay we went... I'd like to say to Ratchet. Looks like it. And then we probably travel down this way. Flew or road. To get to... Dustwallow Marsh. To Theramore Isle. And then we quested throughout all of this. And then... I can't remember if we went. We might have come down this way. I don't think we went through the Southern Barrens this way, but we could have. 
We could have. It was a long time ago. Um, and then we went to the Thousand Needles, of course. Quested through that. Went south to where we are right now. I'm flying about. And then we went to Ungoro Crater, then Silithus. And from Silithus, we took a portal after we were done, which took us back to the Eastern Kingdoms, took us to the Blasted Lands. Yeah, we did the Blasted Lands. And then we went north to the Swamp of Sorrows, and then via this path, I believe we went all the way up to the Burning Steps. And the Burning Steps, we went through Black Rock Mountain to the other side to Searing Gorge. Through Searing Gorge, we went to... Now this part, I'm not too sure. I don't think we went to the Badlands immediately. I think we went up... I think we went up here first. Went through there, and we made our way to... Lochmadan, and then from Lochmadan we travelled down south, and then we went to the Badlands, I think. From all of that, we went back up north, we went through uh, the Wetlands, through the Hint, through the Arathi Highlands, to the Hinterlands, to the Western Plaguelands, then to the Eastern Plaguelands, and we flew all, we took a rocket ride all the way back to the Badlands, then we went on a Boat ride, right? From Menethil Harbour. Back to Dust Swallow Marsh. Back over here. To Dust Swallow Marsh. Followed that through. Did the Southern Barrens. Went through. Oops. Yep, went down back here through the Thousand Needles. Then we went to Feralis. And we completed Feralis. And that brings us to this point. <laughs> That's a lot. A lot of questing, folks. And yes, I do have my orc shaman. And if you ha you may have noticed that, um, or you might have seen the series where I went through with the orc shaman and uh, did a fair bit. But that guy will continue. I wanted to make more progress than this guy, and then I'll I'll switch on over back to him. Now, the robot chicken. I thought it was over here. Oh, there it is. There is a robot chicken, but. I need to get the egg first, right? 